I can't step out and go to the store for two damn seconds without somebody coming in here, rearranging and alter, uh, altering my stuff. I know exactly how I have things. I have not used these rollers in so long, and they was not turned that way. These are rollers. They was not situated like that. They were not turned away, and I have not used them. As you can see, they brand new. I'm the only one in here. All I did was step out and went to the store. But every time I come back, these people's coming here with this same shit, always bothering this stuff. And it's bad enough they got me sleeping in a damn beauty shop instead of giving me my house back because I um. And it's bad enough again they got me sleeping in the motherfucking beauty shop and I can't leave without them coming in here fucking with this little shit every day. Ain't nothing in here worth no value. I can't leave without them people coming in here and keep fucking with this stuff every day. I know they trying to do a clone of me. I know um, Trump got Gwen them and Lawrence Weekly and the states of Nevada and Nevada. All them, I'm alleging that Trump got all them allowing them to use a lookalike or a clone. Everybody wants the case because I'm the one that filed those original documents. I'm the one that shut every government down worldwide. Technically, I have not wrapped it up yet, so therefore I'm not going to budge. I'm not going to do absolutely shit until I am rescued and free. Everything is at a standstill. I cannot leave here. I go, when they falsely arrest me, the police officer take a picture of me with cameras, with lights so bright. I swear it was the sun trying to make me look like a white woman. They want a, they want a white Samaya. Mexicans trying to get a white Samaya. Gwen and um, Trump and them, they trying to get their little black Samaya. Everybody trying to clone motherfucking Samaya because she won this case. And this is a problem I have. And the original motherfucking Samaya is still sitting here at this beauty shop. Can't even get my house back because somebody else over there. Can't even get the house back. Can't do shit because... And the, um, purple those who call themselves christians because i have one that case basically which would ban that device some people call it the mark of the beast but i call it it's just that medical monitoring the device that's everybody in, uh, is under surveillance and being tracked and because i banned all such activities all now the christian people we call them refer to them as purple purple feel like that you should be um, humiliated. When, in other words, their bishops, the way they're trained is, God have to humble them, put them through some humility bullshit. They have to go and walk the streets for two years, knocking on doors, pretending like they poor. That shows them they heart and if they really care about a person. But yeah, this is what they doing. Blacks don't believe that. Blacks believe we was born kings and queens. If God promised you something, he ain't no damn Indian give you. He God ain't going to bless me with my house, bless me with my pool, and everything was given to me by my family. Faith, ain't gonna bless me with it, ain't gonna take it back from me because he's trying to figure out who I am. That don't even make good common sense, Purple. That don't make good common sense. So, Purple, the Pope, Christian leaders, that's what they're doing. Because I did ban this device technically on paper, it's not finalized yet. They want to make me live poor for a few more years so they can rewrite the lies in the Bible, in the Holy Bible. So, they want to rewrite all the lies in the Holy Bible again. So it's going to make me uh, poor so they can say, oh, she had to walk the streets. No, it's called torture today. 3,000 years ago, maybe she did walk, they had to walk the streets. I had a Hummer truck, Purple. You stole it. Your police officer came and got it. You're holding it hostage. I have a Hummer truck that's fully paid for. I have a half million dollar home that's fully paid for. No, I didn't have to walk the streets, Purple. Just release my shit bag. Um, you're not getting that story in the Bible. You're not getting that story. We're not rewriting no more lies. It's over. It's over. This is religious torture and it is over.